Good morning, everyone. BC, of course, is here, and thank you for joining me today. I came in quite early this morning. I'm here solo by myself. I left the house a little bit after 6 a.m., traveled to Riverside, did some errands out there, and then came over here. Hello, Sonic, FK8. So as I came through, um, I had a very busy day yesterday, being Wednesday, and, and a lot of traveling, a lot of figuring things out, playing with the dino, so on and so forth. Now, what's interesting is as I came in this morning, I started going through my packages and something really exciting came in. So I want to be able to work with you guys to show what's, what came in and open up a package. So for those of you on YouTube, thank you so much for joining me. This should be very exciting. Hello, Bugsies. And I'm actually on Instagram Live right now, YouTubers. So that being said, hey, Hedy, good seeing you. Um, okay, so let's, let's open up what came. So, some items came from AEM, which is pretty exciting, and no one has ever seen these items, ever. Okay, guys, this is the new VCU 200 kit. It is from AEM EV, the new EV division of AEM, and I use some AEM technology in my crazy 935K3, but this is now the commercially available EV unit. This is the new ECU, in this case, a vehicle control unit, for motorsports, for street driving, completely legal to convert cars to EV. So, you're gonna join me in opening up the very first box kit ever. First one, um, well, first one in the field. This one has serial number 006. I wanted 001. But I think the five of them are in house at AEM. Okay, so let's open this up together, guys. Join me. Let's see what's inside the VCU kit. I also have a pin kit for the power distribution unit and also the VCU itself. So let's open this up and see what is inside. I've never seen firsthand how the finished product is. Played a lot with beta stuff. Got a lot of information from the team. They helped me tremendously with the car behind me. So let's see what's in here. All right. So box is opening up. Well, you guys get to see before me. Look at this. That's a pretty unit. That, that is pretty. It's like a Wow, it looks very motorsports, very OEM. You know, I play around with a lot of OEMs with Hyundai and Honda and so on and so forth, and this ECU looks very close to like what you see in those high-end vehicles from Bosch or whatever the case may be. So I'm opening this up. Wow, this is, wow, there it is. <laughs> I cannot, no, this is gonna be the basis of a lot of the projects I have moving forward. This very same VCU has nice minor points, looks very robust. Very elegant looking, um, very modern. Look at that, guys. What do you think? Lots of hearts. Thank you so much. Look at that, YouTubers. Look at this. So this is the VCU 200. And now what's cool about this? So on the car behind me, I have a beta setup on it, uh, or programming from Jason. And the strange thing about this is I don't have launch control. I have limited safety opportunities in terms of fail safes. This ECU, this new VCU from AEM will allow me the opportunity so have all of that. I can do launch control. I can have fail safes built in for my contactors. I can monitor information and communicate with the BMSs. Um, I can use buttons to start the car or keys to start the car or a lever to start the car. I can do really cool stuff with it. We can tune, you can take away power, you can, have, you can manage torque. You can make a car behave like a petrol engine or stay as EV, so that's pretty cool. Um, what is in the box? Oh, so I have pins for socketing and a user manual, quite simple, huh? So that being said, I wanna see what the pin kit looks like. So I'm gonna put this aside right here in the back of the car. And um, BCU 200 pin kit, let's see what that looks like. So guys, thank you once again. I knew you guys uh, starting your day, but oh, I was really excited when I saw this package and I had to open it up with you guys, my family, to see what's going on. So, Oh, this looks like a plug-in pin kit with a, a pink plastic bag. Paying homage to the uh, 935 behind me, yeah? Thank you, AEM. I appreciate that. All right. So, yeah, I have a, a variety of pins here and little vacant hole fillers. More pins, different size this time. And connectors, looks like I have connectors. 
two connectors. These are, this is really nice stuff, nice motorsport quality stuff, which is pretty good. Yeah, okay, so what I'm gonna do is um, I have three vehicles here that we're going to electrify. So that being said, I would love for you guys to join me on that journey of electrification. And we're gonna test the launch control and do all kind of cool stuff. I'll talk a lot about a fail safe. So if you haven't subscribed to my YouTube channel, please do, BC Moto. And I'm gonna be putting a lot of stuff here. So I have a petrol engine in the back there um, with the AM Infinity that we're gonna be doing some crazy stuff with as well. And I'm gonna be doing some EV stuff as well. So it should be pretty nice. So AM, thank you so much for joining me on the journey to electrification. The future of tuning is bright and thanks to you, we can do some wonderful things. And I'm glad to have one of the first units that ever existed on the planet. I'll, I'll throw this on the site. Um, it's really cost effective. It's like, not bad at all, less than $2,000 for this, this vehicle control unit. This one controls uh, a single motor. They have another unit coming out that will control up to four motors, which is pretty cool. So guys, thank you so much for joining me this morning. See you soon and stay safe. Bye-bye.